Okay, so we have a shoulder injury here. And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take a look at one non-injured shoulder and one injured shoulder to illustrate the thumb up the back pattern, okay? Super valuable. So on Christine here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the good shoulder and I'm gonna show you guys what a, what a healthy shoulder looks like. And in this case here, you can see that the shoulder blade is visible. It's popping up nicely. The elbow is dropping nicely. And I've got the middle finger here coming up into about the T6 area, your, your um, sixth thoracic vertebrae. Okay, the bottom of your shoulder blade is roughly around T7. And her finger goes about one vertebral level higher. So that's what we're gonna do. And this is our basis for our starting point here of what the healthy shoulder appears like, okay? And no pain. Now, let's go over and take a look at the bad one. On this one, as I place the thumb and the hand up the back, the shoulder blade is being trapped. The shoulder blade won't lift, okay? So, so look for this, look to see, and also the elbow. Now, if I come up higher with the hand and I, and I place a greater amount of torque into that joint line, it's gonna hurt and the elbow is gonna hang up. As you can see, the elbow sits up much higher here and the shoulder blade looks really wonky. While I can see the bottom pole of it, it's clearly not liking this position at all and it's being trapped. So let's take a look at how we can fix these problems here, which is by actually putting the arm into the position that hurts the most, but not foolishly. So I'll back away and I'll try to find the location of the hand. So what I'll do is as I back the hand away, all the way back down by the buttock here, ah, look at that. Suddenly I found a place where the torque on that humeral bone it wasn't so extreme and the arm was comfortable enough to be able to fall to the ground. So I'll bring it back up again and you'll see, oh, look at that. So as soon as I hit that point of torque where the injury is picked on too much, the elbow will rise up just as you see right there and the front of that shoulder is gonna hurt. So this is a front shoulder pattern here with a classic thumb up the back assessment, which is what we're gonna use to actually fix the joint line.